Um, Tom Titus asked me to give a talk on joint replacement surgery. And that's, and when he asked me that, this is what goes through my head. This is what joint replacement surgery is like. There's knees and hip resurfacing up here, hip arthritis. It's this complicated. It's this big a story. And, and for today, I can really only cover like that dot right there and maybe that one there. So I know some of you have problems with your hips or, who, or have had problems with your hips. And if I don't cover your particular story or if I say something that doesn't click with you, let me know and I'll be happy to answer some questions at the end. Um, as much as uh, part of the talk will focus on hip replacement, but, but in America, in North America, the main reason for doing hip replacements is for the diagnosis of osteoarthritis. And that is a very specific disease. It is um, not just soreness in the hip that you get a pill for. for. For an orthopedic surgeon, osteoarthritis is very specifically the loss of cartilage from the hip joint. The normal bearing surfaces in the hip are a round ball, the femoral head with a lining of cartilage, and then a cup, a socket, that also has a lining of cartilage. And so the normal bearing is cartilage on cartilage. And, and you've all heard the phrase, well, the doc said I'm down to bone on bone. And in fact, that is what happens. There is a very specific anatomical change um, that we see at the time of surgery. It is not a vague thing. It is not aches and pains. It is not just feeling my age. It is a very specific problem. <clears throat> 